guys are really going to save Western Civilization. For Jones is going to save Western Civilization. Mr. Marcus Seven is going to save Western Civilization. Guys, don't believe the hype. Whenever I go to YouTube, the thing that makes YouTube even more than the actual videos is the comment section. And the comment section is where we get a lot of funny input and all of the guys are trying to be deep and analytical. But it seems that everywhere I go, there's somebody that falls into the hype. And of course, it's not just on YouTube, it's on other venues for social interaction on the internet. You know, more shallow mood points of social interaction, nonetheless, yet it seems that some people really think that Fringe Elements is this guy that's going to try to bring about the salvation of the West. That he's really this guy that has it, that he has it on lock, and that he's going to be, solve the race problem, he's going to solve the problem of our modern, ultra-liberal, democratic, capitalistic government. He's going to He's going to deal with all of it. It's all going to be solved. And that's that. It's not just him. It's a lot of other people. And thankfully enough, I know that some people do get it. There are guys that are too crazy for the tubes or for anyone to fall into their hype. But still, it does bother me because I'm one of those people that I was a fan of Fringe Elements and I know Fringe is going to get tight when I say stuff like that since it's a walking cliche. I love the views until this point, but not really. I was a fan of his videos. I love what he did. I try to imitate his style a little bit in terms of speaking up and the confidence I have in my voice right now, but other than that, the guy is unconcerned with the West. He's not Grog. He doesn't care for what we once were. He doesn't care for what we'll become. Maybe in a materialistic sense, he does care for all these things, yet it's not going to be in a way that's satisfactory for anyone that's really dreading the modern the modern world and all of its disadvantages in terms of how unhappy we are and a lot of you guys want girlfriends you're probably not going to get any. A lot of you guys want real people to form positive or negative relationships with friends, enemies. That feel when you're not going to get it. And you guys want meaningful lives that will snatch you from mortality to the threat of the universe. Actually, I'm going to stop being a dick. You probably will get all of these things if you apply yourself. The current political framing and situation, that's a big concern most people have. Are we going to be seeing the end of all of this at the end of our lifetimes? Maybe, maybe not. I don't have a crystal ball. But I certainly know without a doubt that Fringe Elements isn't going to usher in an age of people that are going to bring back the rest. And the same goes for all those other kind of guys that the reactor sphere loves even though they don't really love you guys. And they don't care about us. I got a hairball because of a fight I just had. Isn't that really sad? I, I didn't get scratches. 
I'm getting here. This show just got a hairball. Probably my own hair too.